we're here for Motorboats Monthly today aboard the new Quicksilver 705. Now this is quite an ingenious little boat. It's actually a 23 foot cabin cruiser as you can see, but they've packed an awful lot into it. For a start you've got this helm position here, it's a nice double helm and there's room for somebody else to sit alongside you. But what they've done is they've made this backrest so it can be slotted out and put into this side and then you've got a dinette. There's a table that lives underneath the floor that sits in between or can be used in the cockpit, a small galley area opposite and then down below they've squeezed in a little heads compartment and a small double berth at the front. It's tremendous what they've got into this boat, it really works quite well. They do this boat with a combination of engines, you can have it with an inboard petrol or an inboard diesel. But becoming ever more popular on this size of boats is the outboard. This one's got a Mariner 150 horsepower four-stroke. It'll actually take up to 200 horsepower, but it works very well on this. It's very well balanced. It runs very nicely. I think it's fair to say that it's no windy. If you throw it into a really hard turn, you'll get a lack of enthusiasm and a degree of cavitation. But it's not trying to be. What it is, in fact, is a very comfortable cruising boat. And considering how biased this is towards accommodation, I've been surprised at just how good it is out here. We've got about a 4-3 or 4, a bit of chop and a bit of swell. It's handling it very nicely. I'm, I'm certainly impressed. So what we've got here then is a nice, comfortable 23-foot cruiser that's actually surprisingly good out in a bit of sea, but actually it's very good value as well because this boat with a decent bit of specification and a sensible size engine can be yours for about £50,000. That's pretty good value.